Ipo 52D destroyer developed independently by China has reportedly received an upgraded propulsion system, a move analysts said on Wednesday was a normal development with continued technological development and production of ships of this class. During the decade-long production of the Type 52D, it is quite normal for new technologies to be implemented in newer ships, the expert said. The Type 52D will be even more powerful with this new technology and the experience that previous ships have accumulated. The Type 52D is highly reliable and uses mature technology, making it suitable for mass production, Wei Dongshu a Beijing-based military expert, told the Global Times in an earlier interview. The flotilla consists of the Type 52D guided missile destroyer Nanning, the Type 054A guided missile frigate Sanya, and the Type 903 comprehensive supply ship Wai Shenhu, with two helicopters and dozens of special operations troops among a total of more than 700 sailors on board. The Nanning, a destroyer independently developed by China, received an upgraded propulsion system among many other modifications, the PLA Navy said in a statement. Since being commissioned, Nanning has joined dozens of major training missions including deep-sea training and combat warning patrols, during which he conducted multiple missile launches, the PLA Navy revealed. Nanning made her public debut in June 2021 in exercises in the South China Sea, and by the looks of it, is an upgraded variation of the Type 052D destroyer with an expanded helicopter flight deck to accommodate the newly developed Z-20 utility helicopter, and a new anti-stealth radar to counter stealth aircraft, media reported at the time. As the main surface combatant type of the PLA Navy, the Type 052D destroyers have been built and commissioned in large numbers, a Chinese military expert who requested anonymity told the Global Times on Wednesday. According to publicly available information and media reports, the first Type 052D, Kuan Myung, was commissioned in 2014, and 25 have been rolled out since. Additional hulls seen under construction in August 2022.